Hey, all right, so first and foremost, I'm going to give all praises to Yahweh, Bashami, or Shai, Bashami, or Kakodash. We see that what I see that apostles and elders are great builds around the world. And so the teachers say, I come out of the push in the wooden of truth and sincerity, day in and day out. We say, Shalom. Right, I just, just, um, you know, a quick response on this video here that a brother, a brother from um, the camp did, right? And, you know, um, it's the title of the, the, the video was that he brother put up was, I commend this jig, he did keep a short watch over his daughter. And that's right. Because when I watch the video, you know, I said, I wouldn't play the video because, um, you know, the copyright rules and so forth with, with, with um, Esau today, right? And, and so, so I wouldn't take the chance playing it, but going into the, um, going into the video, a brief explanation of the video, that, that is, um, that is someone's daughter that that put up a video talking and and shaking her ass on the on the internet you know i'm putting it up on the social media sites and the father caught her and um the father saw caught saw the video and basically he he cut her ass right right he spared he spared the rod right and um and i myself that that he did the right thing because going to the scriptures that is the right thing because your daughter basically whoring out whoring out herself and anybody that anybody that disagreed what the father did you basically um wicked because if you love a child you wouldn't want a child be doing this right um i'm going to the scriptures here you know this and and this is basically a video for like for your children on the whole mat no matter if it be male or female right um sp um the spirit road on them Right, and and make sure you grow them up in the right way. As the scriptures say, right. This is um the book um is Ecclesiasticus chapter thirty verse one. Right, you say he that loveth his son causeth him oft to feel the rod. Yeah, so if you love if you love a child, you make him feel the rod. Right, if you if you love a child, you make him feel it because in a day you love him, you want to see him go down the um the wrong path. Even even the um even the Lord said that unto us. The same way, the same way a father love his uh, for his son, the same way he have um, the same way uh, a father chastises his son, the same way he will deal with us, right? So it says, "He that loveth his son causeth him off to feel the road, that he may have joy of him in the end." Yeah, because you know what, you were a son, you were a child. On the whole, as I said, this video is for both both male and female um, um children, you know, and um, if you love your child. You'll want to see a child come out the right way. On the end, you'll you love to see a child come out the right way. But how are you going to do that if you discipline them? Because in idea, you have to set discipline. It's the same, as I say, it just join a reference. You see, may the Lord deal with us, right? Um, yeah, so reading over. He that loveth his son causeth him off to feel the rod, that he may have joy of him in the end. Right? It says, he that chastiseth his son shall have joy in him and shall rejoice of him among his acquaintance. Yes, yeah, shall rejoice of him among his acquaintance. You know, and that's right. You'll have joy in his son because you know what? You grow him up in the right way. He'll be, he'll be in, in, in his right mindset. Right? But someone who is not growing up a child in, a, in the right way, they, they, they won't have joy. You know what? They will always have that dis, dishonorable feeling about the child and that is, that is most of these shakes today because you know what they're not disciplining the child right let's say he that teacheth his son grieveth the enemy and before his friends he shall rejoice of him that's right because you know what yes your son go always be in a right state a right mindset so amongst amongst your friends or amongst your family and so forth you'll be proud of your son because he he on the right path right even in a shoot you had to, you had to grow up your child the right way if he went if you, if you want your child to be on the on the way of the Lord, if you if you're doing the right thing, then that child go on go on be um wayward, right? Let's see. Let's see. He that teaches his son grieveth the enemy, and before his friends he shall rejoice of him. Though his father die, yet he is as though he were not dead. Yeah, cause you know what, your child will always remember that what 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 the what the father what the father did, right? That and he will remember the cut as he feel. So you know what he will always be on a right path. He was you know, not to bring shame upon his father, right? Let's say, though his father die, yet he is as though he were not dead, for he had left one behind him that is like himself, right? You see, while he lived, he saw and rejoiced in him, 
and when he died he was not sorrowful he left behind him an avenger against his enemies and one that shall requite kindness to his friends he say he that maketh too much of his son shall bind up his wounds and his bowels will be troubled at every cry right he say an horse not broken becometh headstrong and a child left to himself will be willful right in verse 9 say cock thy child and he shall make thee afraid play with him and he will bring thee to heaviness yeah you keep on playing with it you keep on playing with a child you keep on and you keep on um when, when, when a child do wickedness and so forth you keep on um you keep on agreeing with a child you know if somebody correcting a child and so forth you keep on agreeing with it your child go bring it to heaviness and that is, that is most of what these parents pay into the burden that they have on themselves, right? You say, laugh not with him, lest thou have sorrow with him, and lest thou gnash thy teeth in the end. You say, give him no liberty in his youth, and wake not at his follies. And that's right. You know, all the people that, all the people that commented on, on, the vi on this particular video and said that the father was wrong, at the, at the end, your son and children um, put all it to shame. Right, most of them is killers, murderers, and so forth. Right, and it say here, give him no liberty in her youth. Yeah, she young right now, so she young right now. So the father ain't giving she no liberty. It had no liberty in that, right? And that way, you call her parent. They supposed to be giving it, your child no authority over you, right? It say um, give him no liberty in his youth and wake not at his follies, right? Yeah, don't wink not, don't, don't keep on telling them, hey, well, you know, he's a child, you go, um, he, he's a child, you go learn in time to come. No, don't wink, don't make that pass, correct, correct your child one time, you understand? Correct him one time, don't make that folly pass, because you know what, once you make it, once you make that folly pass, folly shall increase, right, it shall increase. It say, bow down his neck while he is young. And beat him on the sides while he is a child, right? And that is what the father did. And as I say, the father not wrong for that. That is putting order in his house, right? It's a bow down his neck while he is young, and beat him on the sides while he is a child, lest he wax stubborn and be disobedient unto thee, and so bring sorrow to thine heart. Yeah, you gotta you show you gotta show a child who who is in authority, even even in the animal world, right? Even in the animal world, um. The head, or the or the head, the father of that 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 pack, they they set order in the pack. They they fight with the younger ones and they beat them, they bite them, and so forth, and show and show and show the respect, show who in authority. So you don't do um do spare that rod, right? Okay, you know what? At the end of the day, when when I watch most of these people, children who disobedience because the parents make them so they not know what they wink at their follies they make them continue it is and when people correcting the child they, they tell the people they're wrong for doing that just like just like somebody comments that that there was still any man in um in the video that he was wrong he shouldn't do that right it say bow down his neck while he is young and beat him on the sides while he is a child lest he walk stubborn and be disobedient unto thee and so bring sorrow to thine heart it say chastise thy son and hold him to labor lest he lewd lest lest he lewd behavior be offense unto thee right and that's right so you know you ain't you, ain't, you want to be um you ain't spain you ain't spain your, um your, your child in no form right okay next scripture here so you know what he was right he'll wink at her iniquity she do he'll make that folly pass he corrected one time right um can kind of scripture here right this is um this is surat this is the same book, um, Surak, which is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 42, verse, um, verse 11. It says here, Keep sure watch over a shameless daughter, lest she make thee a laughing stock. 
to thy enemies yeah and that will go on because plenty of his friends will be watching this video and um and laughing at him you know hey what going on with the daughter by by john by what going on with the daughter by what she doing on the internet here she she twerking she whining where is this who's the father in that who's who's the head of the house you know yeah you, you become a laughing stock so what the scripture is telling you you know it's a keep a show keep a show watch over a shameless daughter lest she make thee a laughing stock to thy enemies and that is what the father did in here he keep he um he keep his eyes on her right it say and a byword in the city and a reproach among the people yeah because she, plain people when you see these videos there's way it was said the next thing she's our a, a whore right a tut right it say and a byword in the city and a reproach among the people and make their shape before the multitude yeah because you know what you're yeah, when you're going to work or you're going to the village people will laugh at you because they'll be seeing the videos and they'll say hey you can't tell nobody nothing about a child when you yourself child talking whining and gaining on, on the internet so that the scripture say yeah keep your eye out on she all right Right, so yes, yeah, so you know, it's keeping an eye on a child, and as I said, you know, there's the scriptures on. I said, I just wanted to make the video strict on, on both male and female, you know, to, to be on a lookout. The scriptures say here, and Surak say, Surak chapter 42, verse 11, it says, keep, keep a sure watch over a shameless daughter, right? To keep sure watch, keep your eye out. The scriptures, right. Plenty of these parents today, they're not watching over the children, they're not correcting the children, they're just making the child do whatever they want to do, right? And again, what the father did here, he ain't do nothing wrong, right? He ain't do nothing wrong. So let me just bring our next phrase up here. Proverbs 22 verse 6. And I agree, I commend, I commend the Jake, commend the, um, the father for doing what he did. And that is the righteous thing he did whooping her ass right this is proverbs 22 verse 6 it says train up a child in the way he should go and when he is old he will not depart from it yes so train a child while they're young right she ain't too old some of these girls today they, they be 12 they be 16 and they're looking like 32 right she may be looking old in her video but she young right so it's a train up a child in the way he should go train that child in the right path they say and go when he is old and when he is old, he will not depart from it. Yeah, she will. Oh, she will remember that cut. She got. A, she got on a video. She so she will know not to do it again, right? She will know not to go on the internet and be talking and getting on so. Right. So you know, again we give all praises to Yahweh, Basham, Yonshai, Basham, Um, Raka, Kodash. You see that man said apostles and elders of grievous and rule well and salutations to the archimons that they push in the wooden of truth and sincerity day in and day out. Right? Constantly in season and out of season we say shallow one. Right? That's it. Train a child the way where a child to, to be, as the scripture said, and in the right way. Right? So with that we give again our praises to Yahweh Shemi Oshai. Until next time, shallow one.